Good morning. Isn't it a lovely morning? Well, I'll tell you this, Bunchy. Um, obviously, the flooding that is happening in New York is insane. And you don't wish that kind of stuff on any city. This has happened how many times now? Every single time it rains a little bit more than, like, you know, average. It just crazy stuff like this happens get that hill prop storm that like to us florida would be like what shot me storm so a little bit of rain to them it was catastrophic what was that sandy i still hear about sandy from yankees when i pick him up and choose me pickups pick him up at the moon for and uh we're like yeah i'll try about store for sandy and i really messed it up this is an embarrassment Lies that race here and should the eel host the principal should science. Sea lion escapes from Central Park Zoo with severe New York City right. flooding. Let's see what this guy does. Now with the letter this venture, he's been taken up guy his store. The inside bank. I don't see anything in this whole air people like the other one fly out the clay and then we classic the park. They stick movies, heating bowls, the clock come up, guys, in just a bit. I thought there was gonna be like a Video of the seal escaping. Do you believe McCartney had the boat? Okay. A sea lion escaped from its pool at the Central Park Zoo on Friday amid severe flooding that's pounding New York City. Howling day, officials said. Zoo staff monitored um, the sea lion as she explored the area before returning to familiar surroundings of the pool in the company of two other sea lions. Jim Breheny, uh, the uh, director of the Brock Zoo and executive vice president of the Wildlife Conservation uh, Society Zoo and Aquarium, said in a statement, "The sea lion never beached the uh, never beached the zoo's secondary perimeter. You mean breached?" Uh, Breheny said, "Come on, ABC News. Uh, the water has since receded, and the animals are safe in their exhibit." He said, "All sea lions and and animals are accounted for and safe." NYPD Central Park sent on social media Friday afternoon while noting that videos circulating online about escaped zoo animals were misleading and inaccurate. The zoo was closed on Friday due to severe weather. Flash flood warnings were issued across all five New York City boroughs uh, on Friday as heavy rain hit the region. Over five and a half inches of over 5.6 inches of rain was recorded in Central Park by Friday afternoon. Five point six inches is going to do this in New York. Are there drains in New York? You're like this is not a third world country. Not that this you know crap on anyone in another country, but like this is one of the biggest cities on earth, and you don't have drains to take care of five point. I mean, I understand that's a lot of rain, but like that's not like overly a lot of rain if you are home stay home new york uh mayor eric adams said at a news conference we could possibly see eight inches of rain before the day is over the rain is expected to lighten up friday night but it won't stop until saturday i don't know i don't really have i guess too much to say on that without like it just doesn't make sense to me at all that 5.6 inches of rain would do this I, do, I mean literally are there no drains I thought you had the, one of the biggest sewer systems in the world in New York like and that where the Ninja Turtles live like that was bad joke I get it but like aren't, aren't you guys known for alligators in the sewers and stuff like that like is there no way to drain this water out? You li you literally maybe you're, well, how how high is New York above sea level? Let's see how high is New York above sea level? Let's see. There's no information available on how how high New York is above sea level. 
Hello, Skelton York is an old village center that stands on a deposit of boulder. Looks like, wait. What? Paris, what are you doing? New York City. New York City is a very low elevation, just 33 feet above sea level. Despite having some of the tallest buildings in the world and being well known for its towers and skyscrapers, the slower elevation is due to its location right on the coast. The highest natural point in the state is Tot Hill. I mean, there's mountains there in New York. It's not New York City. 33 feet. Um, That's... That, like, the highest point in Pinellas County is, like, 33 feet. Highest point Pinellas. To, I'm probably off on that. By a little bit. It's not much, though. 110? Looking north of intersection of State Road 580 and Countryside Boulevard. Okay. Do the small side and high population. Probably other than blah, 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 blah. Okay, 110, like, here, the, the top graphical map. Okay, here we go. I mean, that makes sense. Now, here's the thing. When we get our hurricanes here, 33 feet is what they said, right? So, for the most part, that is, that's 30. Why is this in meters? I'm dumb. I can't do meters. Yeah, not not that high. Florida's not that high. Anyway, the whole point is that it's not much. It's basically the same as where I live. And we know, I mean, we have... Okay, I can see it. We get some we get flooding. We don't we don't do well with we flood a lot. I mean it drains quickly. But it does flood here, so maybe I'm just talking out of my butt. Who knows? I help you. No. Keep going. A seal got out or it didn't get out, but the flooding in New York. Flying around oh. in the water. Oh. Yeah. Distractions. That. What? We have Papa Rich to show me on camera because I look hot. Okay. Well, anyway. <laughs> Let me know what you think down below. Uh, and let me know if you have more insight on this whole New York situation. Just looking into it a little bit. I mean, I can kind of see it a little bit more, but still. I don't know. It seems a bit rough. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you on the next one. Keep it wild. Yes.